Well, hello, you amazing, beautiful people, and welcome back to another Judd reaction video. I can't believe these Judd reaction videos have actually become a series. All of you seem to be loving his recommendations, so let's just keep them going. This has been so much fun. Judd is a good friend of mine. He streams over on Twitch, for anyone who doesn't know, and he recommends random songs. At the moment, we're going down a country rabbit hole. It seems like sometimes he likes to make me laugh, but most of the time, he likes to recommend songs that make me cry. So... I'm excited to see which one he's recommended right now. I go into all of these blind with this song right here, Conway Twitties, That's My Job. I know nothing about it. I haven't heard this song before. I've never heard of this man in my life. So this is going to be a completely blind reaction. Anything I know is Judd has recommended this to me. If anyone doesn't know Judd, I will leave a link to his Twitch channel in the description. I'll also put something up on the screen right around now. If you want to go and show him some love over on Twitch, he's an absolutely lovely human being. All of these songs come from him. So if you like these songs, you're probably going to love him. Anyway, enough of my talking. Let's jump straight into my first time ever reaction to Conway Twitty's That's My Job. I know I'm pausing it really early on, but it's actually creepy how much this teddy actually looks like my teddy. The one I got when I was first born. I've kept it my entire life. Um, I got it like uh, recreated because it was falling apart. It's downstairs right now. It looks so much like mine. It's freaky. I woke up crying late at night when I was very young. I had dreamed my father had passed away and gone. My world revolved around him. I couldn't lie there anymore. So I made my way down the mirrored hall and tapped upon his door. And I said, Daddy. I'm so afraid How will I go on With you gone that way Don't want to cry anymore So may I stay with you And he said That's my job That's what I do Everything I do Is because of to keep you safe with me That's my job, you see I know why Judd's recommended this one So I'm uh, I'm a father of two uh, Both boys um, My youngest is just about to turn six months old My oldest uh, will be free in December I love him Everything I do is for those boys. They are my entire existence. I see myself as nothing but a battery for them. And like, I'll work myself tired every day just so they never have to, you know, just so they can have a, a fun life and live it how they want. And I tell Judd this, I've spoken to him about it, I've spoken to viewers about it before, so I've got a funny feeling that's why he's recommended this song. Also, I'm not close to my dad, sadly. I don't have a good relationship with him. He's, uh, he's not much like me, and because uh, I'm quite sensitive emotionally, um, he's not a big fan of that, so. Later we barely got along, this teenage boy and he. Most of the fights, it seems, were over different dreams. <coughs> we each held for me. He wanted knowledge and learning I wanted to fly out west I said I could make it out there If I just had the fare I got half, will you loan me the rest? And I said, Daddy, I'm so afraid There's no guarantee in the 
the plans I've made And if I should fail Who will pay my way back home And he said That's my job That's what I do Everything I do Is because of you To keep you safe I'm gonna say this right now, Judd. If you're watching this reaction, you're an asshole. Stop giving me these kind of songs. Stop! I don't enjoy crying. I don't. I just, I just don't hide it. But I don't enjoy it. It's not fun. I don't like sitting here thinking about a day when I'm not here for my boys. I don't like it. Man, my son is so like. They're both at such amazing ages now for so different reasons. My youngest is just smiling at me all the time with this big toothless grin. It's the cutest thing in the world. And my oldest, just every every word he says, every word a two-year-old says sounds cute. Every single word. They say truck, it sounds adorable. I wish I could just freeze time in this moment. This 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 is breaking my heart. But Conway, absolutely amazing voice. I love this song. I love the guitar style. I love his voice. I love his sound. This is my kind of country music. I love this. <clears throat> Woke up early one bright fall day To spread the tragic news After all my travel I settled down Within a mile or two I make my living with words and rhyme And all this tragedy Go into my head and out instead has been some poetry, but I say, Daddy, I'm so afraid. How will I go on with you gone this way? How can I come up with a song to say I love you? Was a uh, that was a personal one. <laughs> I feel like Judd's attacking me with, <laughs> with this one. <laughs> that was a personal one, man. Jeez. <sighs> so some some personal stuff about me for anyone who wants to know before I before I comment on Conway. Um, with my with my like, I used to be so close to my dad. I used to love him. I used to see him as this amazing role model. And it wasn't until I got older that I realized a lot of what he was doing was wrong. Um, but it wasn't until I had my own children that I started questioning my parents' emotions, you know. And um, there was just, like, things that they were doing and they would say and they would do. And I was just like, I'd never do that with my boys. Like, and it and it just caused a lot of... It, it, got, it got bad. And now, yeah, and I don't have a good relationship with... Um, with my dad anymore sadly um and it's not it's not my choice um i put it in his hands and he pretty much gave me the finger so i don't have a good relationship with my dad <clears throat> but with my boys whenever i look at them whenever i think about how i feel towards my father i will make sure 
that when they are my age, they never feel the way I feel about my dad, about me. And everything I know that my parents did wrong, and uh, because of that, I'm not close to them. All I can do in my life, because I don't, I'm never, I don't know if I'll ever get that relationship with my father, um, is to make sure that I don't do those same things with my boys. And then hopefully, hopefully something like this, this beautiful, amazing song here, hopefully I can have this kind of relationship with my boys and then they can have it with their sons and so on. And I can start an, an, a new right. That's what I want. Oh, man. I won't get too personal. I'll keep it vague. <laughs> but yeah. Um, Conway. The thing with music like this, the way, the best way to look at music is, did it make you feel something? Did it send your mind to somewhere else? Did you feel it? Did you feel the emotions? Did the words carry weight with them? Did it make you think of your father or your children or your mother? Did it make you think? Did it make your mind wander like that? And if the answer is yes, then that just shows you what a fantastic song and artist Conway is. Because... Any artist who can make a song that makes your mind tell its own stories about your own memories, that is a fantastic writer and a fantastic artist right there. I always say that any song, any artist that can make you feel, that can draw up your emotions, that can, that can send your mind spiraling, that can make you cry, it's true talent. <laughs> and Conway absolutely crushed this. <laughs> absolutely beautiful. This is my kind of country music. It's that softer vocal acoustic or country music with nothing added it's just a raw talented vocalist just singing from memory telling us stories and that's why i love country music so much it just feels like storytelling it feels like someone sits down and they're telling you a ghost story or a story of their past but they're doing it with a guitar and with song and they're just telling you a story that way and i love it because i love listening to stories i love storytelling and i feel like country music is just a musical way of telling these amazing stories and it's usually really personal and really beautiful and really emotional. And sometimes it's really funny and sometimes it just hits you straight in your heart and you can't help but well up. And I love both of those. This was beautiful and it definitely felt very personal for me. I think I held it together quite well. Um, I cannot tell you how hard that was. But yeah, Conway, absolutely love his voice. I love this song from start to finish. Love the style of it. Love the guitar playing, everything about this. This is my kind of country music. I hope you've all enjoyed this reaction as well. Like I said, these all come directly from Judd. He's a lovely guy. Go support him on Twitch. I'll leave a link in the description to his Twitch channel. Um, he's a really nice guy. Just go go give him a follow. He's lovely. Um, I don't get anything from it. That's not that's not why I'm doing it. If anyone's wondering, it's, he's just a friend. And uh, he gives me his recommendations. And I just love him. I think he's an awesome guy. Um, so yeah, it's good to spread the love in this world. I hope wherever you are, you have an absolutely wonderful weekend ahead of you. Thank you so much for taking some time out of your Friday and spending it with me here. I really appreciate all of you, and I hope you're enjoying these random country reactions. They're a lot of fun for me. Anyway, I love all of you. Have a wonderful weekend and a wonderful evening. And as always, my friends, you will see me in the next video.